What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Y'all, we about to get into Cardi B links up with husband Offset after performing in front of a huge crowd. But the main point we're going to talk about is the fact that she got some meat from him by the end of that night. I'm fighting for my life right now. I'm literally fighting for my life right now. Like, I am so sick. And I don't understand, right? Because when I was in New York, I was going out with sweaters. <coughs> um toes out everything i was good soon as i land in miami bro i'm i be telling people i am allergic to miami i'm allergic to florida i'm, I'm allergic to the state like i'm allergic to the state like it doesn't even make no sense like was i clubbing with my baby father yesterday yes oh it's in here Did i got down yesterday absolutely baby i'm not gonna put my y'all can use your rose on new year's eve i need some on new year's eve girl first of all the fact that it was already in the video just pissed me off because we just went on a tangent looking for it that's number one but number two y'all cardi b came out and cussed all of us out i'm talking about cardi b was like did i say that did I do that? Did I? Uh, Y'all see me with a nigga? Did I F with a nigga? Da da da. Only for her to get dick down on New Year's. I cannot believe this shit. I, Cardi went off on us. <laughs> Y'all, I'm talking off too. Yelling, top of the lung, veins poking out. 444 four, four in the chat. Like, to uh, to then say, I don't know about y'all. Y'all might not want no D on New Year's, but I do. <laughs> Everybody might have been getting some D, friend. Well, I wasn't. But I'm just saying the people that get D was probably getting some D. But, friend, you went back to Offset again. Yesterday, absolutely, baby. I'm not going to put my... And, and it was good. Absolutely, baby. Absolutely, baby. I'm not going to put my... Y'all can use your rose on New Year's Eve. I need some on New Year's Eve. She said, y'all could do whatever it is that y'all feel like y'all need to do on New Year's Eve and y'all do that. But what I'm going to do is my... That what she did. I just wanted y'all to know that or whatever. Okay. She did her performance thing. She probably was thinking about that shit mid performance. I think that stopped a lot of people from leaving, y'all. Is that not arguable? Like, I'll leave your ass. You be like, but who gonna do it to me like the way you do it to me? Because that's why I'm with you in the first fucking place. I mean, I love you and all that other shit, but like, you do it to me real good. I mean, if Erica Dixon and Scrappy could get back together. Hello. But, baby, sometimes that sex will keep you around. Okay. You know what? I forgive you. <laughs> okay. I forgive you. But don't play with me like that. You know what I'm saying? Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. This whole time, I'm thinking a 9 mag dude is a damn... AI. That's he a grown ass man. I run this bitch like cardio. Yeah, diamonds just up in a jam. I said I like it like that. All right, so we're going to get into Kevin Gates. All right. I just want y'all to hear what he had to say first, and then we're going to talk about it. Be different. Hey, I got a question. Talk to me. Hey, I, I love you. You love me? I love hey. you too, bro. You know hey, that. I got a question. Talk to me. You ever seen Flowers Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hell no. You hey, you'll do me a favor. Hey, you'll do me a favor if you do. Talk to me. You'll put my feet in there, please. Put your feet. Yeah. Shit. If, if I felt like something was wrong with you, I would. Put my feet there now. Yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. You're going to go for that ride. But guess hey, what? That's all I ask of you. Yeah. Hold me accountable. You're one of them ones. <laughs> so. So. Y'all, st wait a minute. Now all y'all are here like, wait a minute. Okay, let me let y'all hear one more time. <coughs> Put your feet on your shit. And subscribe. Hell no. You hey, you'll do me a favor. Hey, you'll do me a favor if you do. Talk to you. You'll put my feet in there, please. 
put your feet. Yeah. See, if, if I felt like something was wrong with you, I would. Put my feet there now. Yeah. yeah. All right, y'all. So for those in the back that don't know what that means, it means that, nigga, kill me. You know what I'm saying? If I ain't, if I'm not who I say I am, if I'm not, you know, if I get to doing some flaw shit and, you know what I'm saying, I'm acting different, da da da, I'm snitching, whatever the fuck, some weird ass street code shit, it mean hang me up. You know what I'm saying? Hang me over the balcony. Get me up out of here. You heard the nigga say you're going to go for that ride, which means some shit going to happen on that ride. You might not fuck around and come back, okay, is what it means. Um, and also holding him accountable as in, bro, let me know when I'm, when I'm tripping, you know what I'm saying? Let me know if I'm showing my ass or whatever, you know what I'm saying? That's basically what it means. And the fact that you just said, I thought he wanted missionary friend. Why the hell would a uh, other buddy just be like, like, look at his face when he said it. It's like he knew what he was talking about. Put my feet now, please. Look at his face. Put your feet. See, if, if I felt like something was wrong with you, I would. Put my feet there now. Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah, you gonna. <laughs> ain't no way we catch both of them lacking like that. On live. Now that would just be crazy. Okay. <laughs> He's like, put your feet. Yeah, nigga. If you got them, if you, if you not doing right. Yeah, you gonna go for that ride. <laughs> I'm going to have to take you up out of here, boy. Boy, I'm going to throw you out the car. Hey, you rolling down the hill. You know what I mean? Niggas is weird. They say weird street shit, but that's all he meant. Hold me accountable if I, you know what I'm saying, if I'm if I'm doing something wrong, if I'm if I'm on some flaw shit, if, I, if I'm doing some whole shit, put my feet now. You know what I'm saying? Kill me. You know what I'm saying? You know how niggas be like, I'll die about it, nigga. Nigga, I, I sit down for I got them. Whatever. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got to have boy cousins to know. Child, these niggas just be. Sometimes I look at them like, or oh, they'd be laughing and I'm like, <laughs> what the fuck that mean? You know what I'm saying? Somebody feel me. You know what I'm saying? Because what I would have just said was, hold me accountable if I'm showing my ass. That's all I would have said. But no, 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 no. Niggas got to say shit like, bruh. If I get to acting crazy and shit, throw me in the dryer. Nigga be like, <coughs> why would I throw you in the dryer? <coughs> this some shit I say to my boy cousin like, oh, see if everybody could give me some excuse, why would we throw him in the dryer. <laughs> I if if everybody could give me a second. What we throwing them in the dryer for? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh child, they'd be like, nigga, no. That just mean you dry him off. Make sure he ain't tripping. That mean his brain wet. But ain't our brain already wet? Let me tell y'all, we were having a conversation. <clears throat> me and my cousins on is water wet, right? Niggas just randomly, black men are really, really nerds and they're really, really smart and they just don't like to embrace that. And I hate that. But it comes out when they talking to me, okay? Cuz, we playing the game. Cuz, say, hey, cuz, I got a question. What, what, what's, got, what's up? <laughs> Is water wet? And I'm like, I think so. I'm like, nigga, if I jump in the water and I get out, I'm wet. How did I get wet if water ain't wet? He said, <laughs> nah, nigga, water ain't wet. You just got wet from the water. You know what I'm saying? He said, uh, I, God, I wish he could explain this. But he was like, nigga, just because the wind blowing, like, just because the wind blowing you don't mean you winded. I cannot explain it. But that conversation was a good conversation. How, nigga, how you going to be winding? 
Have you ever said, I'm winding right now? You know what I'm saying? They're going to say that wind blowing. But if it's blowing on me, am I winding? <laughs> this what niggas... <clears throat> This the type of shit when they not talking about pussy. This the type of shit that they talk about. But whatever, I, I'm gonna ask him to say it again one day. How he said it, it went perfectly. You know what I'm saying, nigga? You got winded. He said, nigga, you can't be winded. You just the wind blowing. It's windy. <laughs> you not winding no. You know what I'm saying? Like, can you imagine? <clears throat> You got on a coat, it's the wind just blowing outside. And you like, damn, I'm winding right now. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. It wasn't even a weed conversation because my other cousin don't smoke weed. But the one who asked the question did. I mean, he will he do smoke weed. But <clears throat> me and my other cousin do not smoke weed. So we're just as in the conversation as the nigga that started the conversation. <laughs> like, anyway. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that down in the comment section below, girl. I just had to tell y'all that and let y'all know that um, Kevin Gates is not in missionary. Okay? Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Bye.